the beginning. What do you know about this game, by the way? Literally nothing. I know about the the like jester character with sunglasses. Only because of memes, I know about him. He isn't a jester. There is a jester character and there is a guy with sunglasses. Those are different. Then I guess it's time for you to become a big shot. Play. Do not. Well, I guess uh, this video is over. We do not play today. Once upon a time, a legend whispered among shadows. It was a legend of hope and dreams in a field of hopes and dreams. There's a legend of light and dark. This is the legend of Delta Rune, which is definitely not just a world scramble of Undertale. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance, bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will roam black with terror, and the land will crack with fear. Then, a heart pounding, the earth will draw her final breath. Only then, shining with hope, three heroes appear at world's edge. A human. A monster and a prince from the dark to banish the angels heaven which is a metal ass fucking album name only then will balance be restored and the world saved from destruction was that too loud by the way no that was perfect okay today, today the fountain of darkness the geyser that gives this land form then stall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. A new challenger appears. And with, with it, it the, balance the balance of, of light, light and, and dark, dark begins, begins to, to shift. shift. Woo! Spook. That's like one of the three things that is said in this game instead of text boxed. This kind of just reminds me of uh, <laughs> the old Resident games starting with the menacing voice going Resident, Resident Evil. Evil for Resident Evil. Two <laughs> Resident for you. <laughs> Two Resident for Furious. Are you there? Are we connected? Oh yeah, originally this was called... This was called like... Um, excellent. I'm gonna let him finish and then I'll say my shit. Truly excellent. Now... We may begin. I thought it was December, not May. First, you must have a seizure at this backside. You must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Which one of these heads is us? <laughs> uh, I like getting head. Uh, well, there's several here. The very cursed one. Uh, the Not the last one, but the one next to it. This? Yes, I this feel like that, that describes us. Uh, this is our emotional state. Okay. Select the torso that you prefer. I'm gonna choose this one. This one. Okay, no offense, but like five of, or four of them were the freaking same. Yeah. That you prefer. These are all the. S these are so fucking similar. Is it, aren't these literally the exact same? Am I blind? I, I think one of them is thicker than the other. Like, by a couple pixels. Whatever this one. This is your body. Do you accept? We have become Frankenstein. 
Do you have body dysmorphia or no? Uh, let's say no for this, for the purposes of this function. Select the head. Oh, wait, now that we have to restart. <laughs> I guess we have, we just have to live with body dysmorphia. Though. We are stuck in an infinite loop of body dysmorphia. Yep. We just can't accept ourselves. Truly, this was the fate that... <laughs> this is the true horror of Deltarune. This is big Deltarune gaming. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form. Now. Let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite food? <laughs> it's just agony. I feed on agony. I mean, fucking the look at edge. Him. I need to reduce this because it's so fucking loud that I can barely hear myself playing. Jeez. I feel like it's either pain or cold. Yeah. Which like, like something inhuman. Are, are we going with the the? The fucking ultra edge, or or the the inhuman monster. To be honest, pain, cold sounds like more edgy to me because pain can be a meme, but cold is. What is your favorite food? Pain. I, don't know. I eat pain. To me, it, it's just like edgy memory that pain. I, I feast upon upon the pain of all creatures. You know that really edgy fucking shitty. God damn game. Um, hatred? No. <laughs> it, it starts with, I hate everyone, this entire rotten world is terrible, and humans are of maggots feasting on its corpse. Isn't there like a YouTube channel literally called I Hate Everything, or...? Yeah, but he's he's the school shooter type, not the, not the YouTuber kind. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Let's go with pain, just because I, I think it, we can agree that's, that's Look at that like the funniest. D. <laughs> what is D your favorite? These nuts. These nuts. Our bloodstream is just full of nuts. What color does does it like the most? There's. I, I want to go with cyan, just because it's the most similar to cyanide. Yeah, that's what I got too. I don't know, that's such a weird- like, you have two blues here, this is- and there's no purple. This is discrimination against me specifically. Please give it a gift. Kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, or voice. Mm. Let's give it a, a, a lot of ambition to create pain. <laughs> yeah. That's the only one out of those that can actually go wrong. <laughs> really? No, I mean like, like, think about it. Mind is good, kindness is good, bravery is good, having a voice is good, but ambition can be negative. <laughs> yeah. Uh, How do you feel? I like about this bodybuilding that? game. How do you feel about your creation? Oh, you love the you love the end of it. it will oh, not... oh, face the thing that should not be. Mm -hmm. So it's fear. It's fear. It's a thing we that should not be. We fear we our fear creation. This. Have you answered honestly? No. Yeah. No? Like, <laughs> just no. Let's be honest. No. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. Huh? Yes. Yeah, I... This is the epilepsy warning, right? Yeah, probably. Understood. Name your vest. It's just a, a Gabor, just a picture of Gabor, but you just photoshop his face into being a fucking goblin. So, so Gabor. Gabrin. Gabrin. <laughs> We called it, Gabrin. It was weird. And what about the creator? Your own name. What is what is the name of Elon's kid? <laughs> well, let's go, Sam's. <laughs> That's Sam. the same. No, Ness. Make it Ness. Oh, perfect. Ness. <laughs> Fuck you. Excellent. Truly excellent. Ness. Excellent Ness. Thank you. For your time. Your answers? Your wonderful creation.
will now be discarded. What, no what, one wait, can what? choose who they are in this world. Your name is... Chris. <laughs> huh? <laughs> yes, yeah, so before we continue, this was originally... Toby just put this out as if it was nothing. It was the chapter one. It was called like informational survey. Mm -hmm. And then it just jump scare you get the first chapter of Deltarune, bitch. Which people didn't even know Deltarune even existed when this came out. So just jump scared with a chapter. Okay. Th this just scrambled my head so much because I was expecting one thing and then... Uh, I, it's not even that I got the rug pulled out of me. I was putting <laughs> out of you? Hole. And I was shot in the head by some guy saying that the game was rigged from the start. <laughs> you got a rug pulled out of you. Someone just put a rug inside of my guts and they pulled it out <laughs> like a Mortal Kombat fatality. It's just that one fucking picture of the guy taking off his pants really quickly. But it's just <laughs> a rug. <laughs> it's just you a never make a video about this please make visuals like that <laughs> well that, that's the whole point that's why i'm saying it so i can make those type of visuals god damn oh anyway who thank who, you who... editors thank you me the editor <laughs> yeah that's what i'm saying thanks thanks for the editors the team of editors that's you basically that's me i, I am the day them it's just gonna be me neptune and fucking bobcat working on this shit uh like okay. genuinely i no offense i will keep referring to uh the editors in this entire the thing the editors <laughs> the team of editors <laughs> professional Hollywood Hollywood style editors that edit meticulously edit every single frame of this fucking video. Obviously, yes. Oh. Okay, who voices Toriel? I can be a uh, cow woman. You're gonna Wait. be goat mom. It's oh. not, it, the community Almost. has calls her uh, goat mom, not cow woman. Okay, I will be a milk. Very good. Also, notice in this picture, the empty bed with all the fucking shit, whereas we have nothing. <laughs> <laughs> we are living that middle child fucking playstyle, but we are not even the middle child, we were the younger child, so we should have everything. Weird, there's something below or under the trophy filled bed. Chris. Chris? Chris, if you do not wake up, we will be late for school. What, what is she, Yoda? <laughs> she's I, like... I, she's like 40, not 400. Actually, she's probably like 4,000, but whatever. So I'm just making her feel young. <laughs> like, like any MILF needs that. <laughs> Can't for you for you to find a sugar bomb me. I mean, that's how you got the place where you are right now, isn't it? <laughs> I freaking wish. Uh, no, not the sun. I will wait outside for you, alright? Dear? <laughs> we are proper school shooter looking. Clothes there are. I guess this I'll... person. Definitely sense to my chemical romance. <laughs> Definitely. It's a red wagon with a rusty bird cage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Hmm. It's your bed. If you go back to sleep, you may miss a lot of important things. Do you go to bed? Hell no. What? We need to find more lore. I have first. not seen that before, actually. Like, what happens if you go back to sleep? It's just the game just ends? Should we try that? I kind of don't want to. Because then we have to go through the fucking intro again. Yeah, fair, fair. There is mostly empty, except for a coupon box. Every coupon is for half of large pizza. All the coupons expired before the book's print rate. <laughs> <laughs> huh? 
<laughs> what is the point of that? <laughs> it's just here, have some fucking garbage. There's nothing useful in the drawer. Get fucked, lol. Also, of course, there's a flower there. Yeah, this... Should I... Wait, maybe I'm not gonna spoil Undertale. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. Religious? There's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. <laughs> this is just... This is just social commentary on our state of life. We, we truly live in a society. We are just a knockoff controller. It's a computer test. There are many boxes on there. It's filled with all the books. Wow, someone is smart. Not couldn't be me. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. I thought it was a water sausage. There are crayons in the drawer. Their labels have long faded and there is no green. It's illegal. Except for this cactus. Wait, can't you just burn the cactus? I mean, if they just need it green. I, I, I was hoping that when you go up to the mirror, you can get a description of yourself. Well, you can. I just haven't clicked it. It's a oh. It's only you. Dun dun dun. Door is I, I'm, I'm I'm somewhat hoping that like the mirror demon from uh, Faith the Unholy Trinity just kind of shows up in the mirror reflection. <laughs> just. You just go into a room, you get to here, and then you just see it dancing over there in the mirror, yep. and then it just disappears. There are many books. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails do not have tails, a scientific refutation. Can snails <laughs> help your garden? Uh, not really. And a signed copy of the history of humans and monsters by Gerson Boom. That was... Th th <clears throat> I don't okay, think I have to say this every single time, but that was also that person was in Undertale. Holy shit, it's an Undertale reference. Wow. You looked inside the sink cupboard. There is a can of Icy's Cool Boys body spray. Sprays for the boys flaming hot pits of flame. I need that. I need that so badly. <laughs> it's Just pizza with the time. And with with the pizza man thing. <laughs> Seems to be almost entirely full. <laughs> well, you can just take it, they aren't using it anyway. <laughs> That's the most... You know what happened? Toriel bought that. While... Without the guy. So it's just like, hey, I bought you some fucking thing. And he's like, thanks, mom. And then he never used it. It's pizza. <laughs> what was it called? Ice Ease Cool Boys Body Spray. Spray for the boys. That is... Okay, that, that still sounds way better than Axe Body Spray. That is so cringe. Wait. Oh yeah, uh, I can hold escape anytime and it will just kill the game. No, I keep repeating! No, 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 let me free, please. Please. You're stuck in the loop. Yep. Of Ice Ease Boys it's uh, a Body Spray. It's a toilet. This is the most important thing in the entire game. Do we flush it? Yes, of course, we're not filthy animals. You flush the toilet. On the shower ledge there's a small container of apple scented shampoo. And a gallon sized container of pet shampoo. Does does goat mom uh, use pet shampoo? Okay, yeah, the real question, are we the pet? No. Or is she the pet? I think it's either way, supposed to this be is this is messed up. This is some um Omni-Man from Invincible shit saying that uh, I love your mother, but more as a pet. Did he actually say that? Yes. Oh, I know why he says that, but Jesus Christ, that's so yeah. You know how fucked up is is hearing that as as like your your own father saying that. Oh my God. No wonder his kid didn't turn out to be a... I, 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 actually, no, I'm surprised his kid didn't turn out to be a monster when that's all he's hearing about. No, he's heard only, only heard that once, literally. Yeah, but if it happens and once, it's gonna happen again. And then he got the shit beat out of him. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't that his entire fucking ability to just get beaten the shit out of There's a yeah. photo on the bridge. It's you, your mother, and your brother. There is no dad. I can relate, Chris. Same. Everyone in this call can. <laughs> there is some <laughs> white fur stuck in the drain. 
there's some cinnamon batter caked on the so stove top because your mother can't fucking clean apparently. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. It's a trash can. That some... just sounds adorable. It's a trash can. It's empty, like your soul. It's a landline phone, but you have already but you already have a cell phone. Behind the times. It's a chair it's a cherry of the beloved living room chair. <laughs> This one, this asset is straight from Undertale, by the way. <laughs> That's why it's called Cherio, because it's Toriel. It's a TV. It doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. Oh yeah, because Toriel always fucking reads about snails instead. It's it's a book of hymns. They are religious bastards. Why does this always happen? Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. Thanks, Yoda. Chris, it is a beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Ezreal visits next week. But I wonder, after the excitement of university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? Welcome to the main theme. You'll hear a lot of this late motif, so get used to it. Oh, the fish woman is a police yep. officer. That's probably the most accurate fucking thing that she could be. And Toriel is... Of course, is... there's literally one parking spot. Yep. There's like... No, I think there's two. Technically. Uh... Ah, yes. Also, she literally brings us into school by holding us hands because she works here. Oh. Oh. Okay, that makes sense why, why she parked it there, but... Yeah. Damn. And that's... you know her? Her? I would have not guessed the gender, but... Uh, yeah, okay. they, look, they, they look very... gender neutral. But yeah, that's... Yeah. that's... Uh, Undyne's girlfriend. Or I guess not, not in this universe yet. Or ever, I'm not sure. Uh, they, I guess I do it because you did the other one. I, I can't come up with a voice for her on the spot. So, does everyone have a... Wait, no, that's not good. Wait, let me just think of... What would... I, I don't want to do one... Re the really annoying one, because I already know who's gonna get the really annoying voice. <laughs> um... So, does... <clears throat> so, does uh, everyone have a... Oh, Chris, we, we thought you weren't coming in today. Uh, we're doing group group projects this month. Okay, this kind of feels like a don't come to school tomorrow moment. <laughs> uh, so walk around and find a partner, okay? What? Uh, what? What am I watching on my phone? It's a schoolwork, of course. Uh, animated schoolwork. And hey, Chris, have you chosen a partner yet? Uh, she's watching anyway. Weeb. She's a super big weeb. What's on the computer's wallpaper is a rotating slideshow of nature images. And rarely an image of two buff superheroes embracing blushing. That's something I would have. <laughs> totally. Alright, these two are important. So I'm gonna voice this guy and you voice her, okay? Okay. Uh, the other ones we can just randomly do. Crisp! I'm very sorry. Tam already have pardon. It's an egg. It's a black and white hard-boiled egg. <laughs> Can I offer you an egg in these trying times? <laughs> Sam's like it already <laughs> has a partner. <laughs> okay. Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. <laughs> I ended up having to partner with Snowy. <laughs> now he keeps turning to me and saying, Howdy, partner. Like a cowboy. He's right behind you, you know. He's okay. right behind me, isn't he? I, 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 now I want to do his voice. Just... <laughs> Alright. Parker? I hardly know her. <laughs> what do you think of that one? Are they right? No? Well, I got news for you, pal. I already got a partner. Scram! Cr 
dress. You know, Jockey to a candy are always Barney's. We're the ultimate academic duo ever since the first gym class. It was Hulo day and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. This guy looks like you're the coolest kid you would have met in the 90s. <laughs> but you met him in 2023. <laughs> so he's just cringe. Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. I do not like that move. Hey, Chris. <laughs> okay. Don't I, give I, I him, don't second. give her a non, don't give her an annoying voice that you, like, hate doing. Because you'll be doing it a lot in chapter two. I, I, I can't pull out feminine voices, okay? Hey, Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? <laughs> okay, Mickey Mouse. <laughs> I guess she's Mickey Mouse. That's it. Or, or, or Minnie Mouse. <laughs> Don't worry, the next one's gonna be much worse than that. Uh huh? Here you want. The, here, you want the, the candy cane one or the one with points on it? Huh? You want to be partners? Um. Probably, I hardly knew you. <laughs> and I could ask Miss Alphys if we could make you... We could make a group of three, uh-huh. <laughs> That's gonna be so terrible. <laughs> also, here's where you find out that Alphys is a miss if, you, if it wasn't a... Also, also, she dresses like a butch lesbian, so... I, I gotta respect the trip. Just give you a sure. Not yet. Yeah, I'm sure. Sorry. Someone else you could ask? You, you cut me off! You cut me off, you fucking cunt! Yeah, I'll pay, you'll pay for this! She just pulls out a knife. You should have not come to school today, Chris! <laughs> she was the school <laughs> shooter and you would never guess by her appearance. And here's the worst. Ah, Chris. Late again, I see. Hmm, you need a partner. Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. I also broke my neck to look at you. Don't wait, Chris. Now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot on this assignment. Pfft, no, I actually want to get an A. Look at the fucking image. What that face. What <laughs> that face. <laughs> uh. <laughs> this fucking meme. As if uh, freaking Mordecai from regular show was just a full-on asshole. Yep, yep. I mean, it's probably the same bird. Do you want to be partners? Do you want to be partners? Okay, I'll ask. Miss Atlas, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? <laughs> just randomly go really high. Hey, what? No, I, I completely forgot what I what voice I gave him. Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort. Abort like my what? parents failed to abort me. What? But, but, but Chris doesn't have a... Noel. No Noel, what, what were you saying? She was just saying we're fine being alone, even though we're technically not alone because we're together, but whatever. Actually, I just wanted to, to know if... Uh... Noel, can you please speak up? Hi. Oh my god, it's the man behind the slaughter. <laughs> I, I'm gonna be voicing Susie because later there's gonna be another character in the chapter one who you will definitely want to voice, so I'm taking Susie. Okay, I, I, I just feel... I swear to God, if Susie's father is a purple man, <laughs> I'm going to lose my fucking marbles. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is his second... This is his second family. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, the FNAF brain rot is hitting so hard. <laughs> Live uh, Susie reaction. <laughs> we need to make, like, we should get her head and put it as, like, an emote. 
Hi, Susie. Doom, doom. Am I late? Oh, oh, oh no, you're, you're fine. We're ju just, ju uh, choosing partners for the next group project and, uh, um, Susie, you're with Chris. Great. She looks like a member of the Ramones. <laughs> now that everyone is here, I'll write the assignment. <laughs> okay, we're gonna stop the game. Brain Blast! Uh, has, has anyone seen the chalk? Uh, this is the third time it's gone missing and you all know I can't start class without some because I'm an idiot who relies on chalk because I can't captivate my audience because I suck at the teacher. Sorry. Sorry, I'm just putting the the, the terrible teacher Jeez, that no, I've had. Projecting <laughs> much? Okay, every time I've had a terrible teacher, they can't like d hold the class without chalk. Like every other one can like properly do class because their presence draws enough, like, you know, their eyes. But yeah. shitty teachers have to have chalk because they, they need something to, for people to pay attention to. I mean, to. the thing is, it can be a huge handicap to not have visuals. And there was a guy in my school who bought, like, a pack of chalk and, they just, and he just kept it with him. And every time the teacher was out of chalk, he just gave him scavers. You know, I was that guy, but for a completely different reason. <laughs> so we didn't have a chalkboard um, from 9 to 12th class. Uh, what we had was like a whiteboard, and you needed like a crayon type of oh, yeah. stuff, like <clears throat> alcoholic pens to, to write on that. Mm -hmm. And uh, sometimes some of the, the teachers would forget to, to take it with them uh, yeah. when they left class. So I would just collect that <laughs> and keep it on, on my person. So when a, a teacher was like, oh, I ran out, or oh, I forgot got mine, I could, could be like, oh, yeah, here you go, have one, but just give it to me back mm -hmm. next time. And I collected so many of those. Just, I still have some. <laughs> Yet another addition to my collection. And you just, like, hold out your thing like you're the merchant from Resident Evil, and it's just all... All of it is just fucking... Yeah, and I would be literally just ask you, yeah, what color would you like? <laughs> what color do you... I have a fine selection of colors on sale, stranger! Hey boy, stranger! <laughs> everyone gets in... Everyone gets in trouble! I, I, I forgot what that was supposed to be corrected. A anyone? P please? Hey, there might be a box uh, in the seat. Uh, oh, yeah. Hey there! Uh, might be a box in the supply closet. Stop talking and settle me, bitch! Oh, fuck with me, you whore! <laughs> this is this. Why don't Susie and I. <clears throat> Good idea, Noel. Uh, Susie, since, since you came in last, why don't you go and get it for me? Hmm. Whatever. <laughs> and and Chris, can you go with her and make sure she um actually gets it and uh, s stays out of trouble? <clears throat> Thanks, Chris. See you later because you're gonna die. Don't worry, Chris. I always thought Susie can be so bad, you know? She'd get a message, uh, that you shouldn't come to school tomorrow because you were cool. <laughs> I'm sure everything will turn out just fine. <laughs> Voice for <laughs> Now I'm never gonna be able to take this character seriously anymore. You're welcome. Click, click, tap, tap. Don't die. Thanks. <laughs> Chris, my head arms, I would take off the school hat and members of you. Bitch. <laughs> Chris, don't listen to why it's not that bad. <laughs>
Why do you make him sound like like a fucking sixty year old southerner? I mean, he he he, he said that he likes cowboys, so yeah, that's what he gets. <laughs> If you like cowboys, you're gonna be a 60-year-old trucker in fucking Texas with no wife, and the, and you're gonna sing songs about how their how your truck left you. <laughs> oh, my transformers of a wife. She took the fucking kids. <laughs> kids are just miniature bumblebees. Your problem survives, so they're beating you up. You're just gonna fail when she doesn't do any of your projects. It's like we always say, Chris. You sues, you lose. <laughs> Down in the sand. Ah, uh, that's not very reassuring, huh? You're fucked. <clears throat> Yo, Chris. I'm sorry if I had just waited to be your partner. The children. I completely for forgot his original voice. So I'm just like. He's it's pretty much the same as I remember it. Yeah, would it have to be hers? She's gonna pound you to pieces, Chris. You know, some people... If the internet has anything to say about it in a really, really bad way, but yeah. And I kick the butts of all those little pieces. Reassuring. Everyone in here is so reassuring. S Sue's very mean, said Egg. Never hatch. Wait, wait, so the egg never hatches, or Susie never hatches? <laughs> yeah, Susie is trans, actually. Uh, I, I wanna hear, um, the egg, the egg's opinion on this. The hard one idea emanates a feeling of pity towards <laughs> It's an object that it still feels bad for you, wow. Uh, Chris, what's the hold up? God damn. I'm not gonna. I'm never gonna leave this place ever again. I'm scared. I'm just gonna watch my animes. Did you know that they, they made a sequel to Naruto? <laughs> Naruto 2 Electric Boruto. No, wait, Naruto Electric Burrito. <laughs> okay, I'm, okay, I need to remember to make that into a picture. Finally, the most important person to ask. Chris? Wait, what the fuck was that I did for you? Chris, didn't I say being late was a bad idea? Hmm, it's almost as if you should have, as they say, listened. Birdly, I'm gonna break your neck. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Of course, she eats chalk. Also, that little exclamation point on top of her head was in Undertale. You got that every time there was an encounter, like a random encounter. So, oh. uh, yeah, she is currently <laughs> coming at you in combat. Cr oh, yeah, I'm Chris. Didn't see you there. Hey. You didn't see anything just now, did you? Hmm. You can't even say. Sorry, girl, I'm a pro silent protagonist. Chris. <laughs> Jojo. <laughs> Just... hey. Oh, ho, you're approaching me. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Sorry, sorry, that reminds me a bit too much of uh, the scene in Spider-Verse where Mouse's uncle is like teaching him how to flirt and it's just putting the hand on the shoulder of a girl and being like, hey. And he turns, please cut that in. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about, but I'll find it somewhere. If you can, f I'll probably ask for that when I add the thing, but whatever. Let me tell you a secret. I freaking love chalk. Quiet people piss me off. You think just because you don't say anything? I can tell exactly what you're thinking. Can you oh tell no, that there's a telepath? Like what did you say? Oh no, she's a telepath. 
<laughs> well, bad luck to her because we're schizophrenic inside. Because <laughs> there's two of us. It's over. I caught Susie eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. Okay, uh, just out of curiosity, who would expel a child because they ate chalk? Even if, if they, they did like the most heinous crimes, <clears throat> I don't think that would be the, the, the straw that breaks the camel's back. I think she has eaten a lot of chalk, that's the issue. They, she probably eaten like an entire room's worth of chalk. Also, is, is me, like, when I say when I say her lines, and I'm, am I way too quiet? Or can you hear me? No, I, it's, it's perfectly audible for me. Okay. <clears throat> so, congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Also, I just think it's a straw that broke the camel's back. Like, damaging property say? is kind of bad, but alone that wouldn't be. But I think she has like a fucking <laughs> list of like one billion offenses, probably most of them being damaged to property. So just, just ignoring the Geneva Convention. <laughs> she's she's a war criminal in twenty states. <laughs> but like. I don't feel like this is gonna break the camel's back. Like, imagine being a war criminal and the final thing that they, they catch you for is eating chalk. <laughs> I also think that they are just... She thinks that people are just looking for an excuse. And if the people are looking for an excuse, no matter how trivial it is, they're gonna find it. So... Also, this... <laughs> editors... This pose that uh, they are in, it's exactly like that one meme where Sasuke is choking someone. Yeah. Uh, at in. <laughs> Susie be like, weakness disgusts me. <laughs> <clears throat> hmm. Just let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So, Chris. If I know, you're gonna pull the trigger. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, uh, it's hard to tell with how it is, but she's a crocodile. Uh, I, I kind of expected that she'd be some sort of reptilian. Why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About the hit movie. Like losing your face. Oh. Nom 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 nom. Was that the bite of 87? <laughs> Was that the bite of 87? <laughs> nah. Chris. You've got a good mother. I slept with her last night. <laughs> It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. Let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk. Mose back to glass. And then, Chris, you'll do. You will do our project. How's that, Sam? Don't bother answering. <laughs> if you haven't gotten it by now, the choices don't matter. So, let's go, freak. So, at the beginning of Undertale, Flower says, in this world, it's kill or be killed. And I think your choices don't matter is the like the thesis of this game, where it's like you have to disprove it. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, because... even in, in the beginning when you were making the character, that was the joke that your choices don't fucking matter. Yep. Lamar get fucked. Can't interact with this. The locker is locked. The locker's <laughs> lock is locked. The locker's locker's locker is locked. The lockers locks, locker locked, lock, 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 lock. Lockers locked. The locker is covered in Jack Jockington memorabilia. Who the fuck is Jockington? Well, Are the you... greatest jock of all time. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? At this dance, all the cha chaperones were giant hawk heads. Based. And screech at any student that made contact <laughs> while dancing. 
<laughs> no hugs He's in this room. Based. Okay. What is a chaperone, by the way? Because I've heard that word. Fuck. It's like a. Wait, wait. That... Can I read it in, in like a very silly voice? Bye. You drank from the water fountain. People put the math on that, you know. Yeah, I like kissing yes. people. What? Realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. No, actually, let's not. I don't want to eat babies. Only full sized people. They taste better. <clears throat> God, can you walk any slower? Or what? Nah, I get it. Not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Yeah, that's why you don't hold your child's hand after they get, become like older than 10. Okay, you can use that for, for flirting. Yeah, I don't like uh, walking around without someone holding my hand. So can you hold my hand, please? <laughs> it's like you make Chris and his 10 20 charisma. <laughs> this is like, fuck off. <laughs> maybe I should have eat. Maybe I should eat your head. <laughs> Come on, freak. This is the freak that can't be real. Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We were just starting to have fun. Woo! Hey, Chris, is it me or is it really dark in there? Ooh, what's the hold up, Chris? Are you gonna go in or what? I don't wanna go in the closet, I already came out of it. <laughs> you can't put me back in there. Well, she's even worse because she's an egg. Fine, fine. <clears throat> Wait, what's the voice? Fine. If you are gonna be a wimp, then I'll... But both go in at the same time. While holding hands. Damn, this voice is hard to keep up while trying to act like angry. See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. That's weird. I can't find a light switch. Guess it's further than Hmm. Uh, kind of a big closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Spooky. Oh no, they're going to Narnia. <laughs> Damn, this is a pretty, pretty big opening to Narnia. I wonder why there's no not more thing. Also, Narnia would get fucked in like five minutes if, there, if someone with a brain cell discovered it. It's like, wow, look at all this free space. We could colonize this shit. <laughs> that's the Fear final... That that's the final book of Narnia. <laughs> the book of colonization. <laughs> oh, God. That's true for so much fantasy, but at least a lot of it acknowledges it. But whatever. <laughs> hey, Cr hey, Chris. I think this closet's... Uh... <clears throat> I think this closet's... Broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. Get fucked. What the? Hey, this isn't funny. Let us out. Let us. Oh no. The tickets. But I don't know, I guess this is just supposed to be paper. <clears throat> Looks yeah, like someone drew dicks on it. It's <laughs> just a bunch of paper with dicks on it. <laughs> I think we found the internet. The penis papers. The, be the, pe the penis papers. Or it's... We got fucking... <laughs> it's... <laughs> Chris, I, I like just Chris just T-posing. Chris just gave up. <laughs> just fuck it. <laughs> Might as well. Fucking, the, the, the 
Kratos falling meme. <laughs> Dream on. Dream on. That thing gets copyright struck so hard. Also, now we have armor. Look at us. We are now blue. V I am the blue man. Dabba dee dabba die. <clears throat> At times you see it flickering. The light only you can see. By second nature you reach out and save. You're now Ness. We've been here for an hour. Well done. We are at that oh, of fucking how, how has it been an hour already? Yeah, the recording doesn't lie, it's been an hour. <laughs> Fuck. It's combat time. You bathe your body in the light. The power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. The pain you had melted away, HP fully restored. Welcome to the eye puzzle. I forgot how the rest goes, whatever. <clears throat> Break on Try through to, to run, try to hide. Break on through to the other side. Break on through. Okay, now we can look at these disgusting. Okay. I don't know what. Okay, there was someone again. Again? Oh, it's her. Hey, back off. Come any closer and I'll... Mm -hmm. hey, Chris? Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Mm -hmm. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> mm -hmm. Anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Mm -hmm. Um, where is here anyway? Doesn't matter. You got us into this mess, you get us out. Lead the way, Chris. Doop, 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 doop. Oh my god, never mind, you walk way too slow. <laughs> <laughs> Me when the NPCs just has the slower walking speed when <laughs> yep. then. We are the NPC all along. Hey, Chris, there's someone up there, waving at us. Any idea what they want? <laughs> Boom! They want violence. Run, Chris! I'm gonna try to hit less. I mean, I guess I gotta have a safe point, but... Ooh, this song is cool. Also, listen for late motives, because there's a lot of them. Chris, down here! No, oh, fuck. Jeez, that's a lot of arrows. Yeah, but not a lot of them are actually going for me, they're just hanging out. Lol. Easy game. Easy baby game. Until we get to fucking jewel. Ooh, spooky. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? Me neither. Wonder if there's anyone in that building up there. Where are the dicks? Welcome to Dick Village, population dick. <laughs> it looks like a shop, but the door is locked. And there's no one inside. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's cocked. Cocked, blocked, and ready to go. In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Castle Town. I'm coming up. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? 
Oh, who the fuck does Welcome, this guy? Heroes. Uh, wait, we're running out of. I guess you can do him as well, and I'll just do Susie. Welcome, heroes. Uh, who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Be not afraid. Be not afraid. Please come forward, both of you. I'm about to put a child in you. Without ever touching you because I'm not gay. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. You're gonna have to change the voice when we see him, by the way. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, un until it's revealed, it, it stays like this. The kingdom of darkness. Chris, Susie, there is a legend in this land. Also, one sec before we go on, I need to send you a picture. Um, so that's of what course. that's what Ezreal looks like, just so you know. Mm -hmm. Okay. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive and fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. I guess. <laughs> it would be funny to just say, no, nah, mm -hmm. we're going home. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Should we actually do that? I'm curious, just for shits and giggles, I feel like, yeah. Um... <laughs> um, uh, really? Are, 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 are you sure? It's, uh, fairly important, heroes. And, um, in my opinion, it's a really nice prophecy. I, I, I think you'd quite like it. <laughs> Already? <laughs> <laughs> Do we keep being a dick? Yeah, yeah. Really? Uh, really? You, you've heard it already? Oh, uh, perhaps I shouldn't have rehearsed it so much. <laughs> Look, dude, you didn't come here for a bedtime story. Just tell us how to get home. Um, the easiest way would be to seal the eastern fountain. You mean, uh, like the water, water bubble or something? The fountain. That which gives the dark world form. Um, are you sure you actually know the legend? <laughs> Look. No. <laughs> <laughs> but I think I've got enough info. See you till later. W wait, let me at least tell you how to... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here's the other character I was like, yeah, you're gonna voice this guy. <laughs> Ho ho ho! One nerd down, two to go! My dad's gonna make me son of the month! He's an only child. <laughs> that makes it even better. Who the hell are you? I'm... The bad guy! Bad guy? You know... Dewdrop headed kid from the legend. We <laughs> didn't the legend. No. <laughs> oh boy, this is gonna be hard to explain. <laughs> I love I love all the fucking pictures. Also it's weird because he doesn't have color. He has color, but we don't. Um I could help explain it. Stay out of this kind boy. No. I protect the heroes with my life. Actually, <laughs> actually, I keep forgetting that I voice Susie. Actually, can you hold off? I want to hear this kid. <laughs> he just leaves. Okay. So long story short, you guys are heroes. You want to go east and seal our dark fountain. So we skip the good guy's explanation so we get the bad guy's explanation. That is outstanding. That will stop darkness from covering the world. We, on the other hand, don't want that because... It would rule and be great! Why do we want to stop that? Uh, I don't know. I guess I could go ask my dad. I could tell you. We got this. <laughs> <laughs> so the point is... You wanna fight us? Correct the 
Mundo. All right, kid. Now you tell me something I understand. Gotta love that she looks like uh, the SCP. Um, oh yeah, she's the hard to kill lizard. I mean, she or she already starts with twenty more health than me. Check warning or compliment. I guess let's check him. Lancer attack seven defense one. Not to call a spade a spade, but he's a spade. <laughs> Not only have to ride a motorcycle, so he set his motorcycle. So he set his bike on fire. That's not an exhaust, it's set it on fire. <laughs> Jeez. Halt, clowns! This bike is fueled by victory! Didn't know how I get an axe, but like, that's cool. Okay. Compliment. You tell Lancer you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. Why is that a compliment? How? Yeah, how is that a compliment? He seems flattered. His attack power went down. That doesn't do much. Oh my god. Oh, you make my oh, feeling... It's my you guy. Make... It's literally my character. Oh, sorry. You're doing my job for me. Also, th the reason for that is because that is, like, when he speaks... Okay, so first off, I have to remind myself to stop doing that. Second off, um... What's it called? Uh, that one is very timed, so be quick. I guess I'm just gonna stab him. Oh. So what are you guys doing after this? After we kill each other. Lancer's riding now. How do I back off? Well, I guess I'm not backing out. Ho ho ho, I'm the bad guy. Just like that Billie Eilish song. That do be me. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. How? Alright, you punkaroos. You had the luck of the draw this time, but uh, next time, the losers will be you. <laughs> Bye, losers. I gotta get home before dinner. <laughs> <laughs> You won, got 0 XP and 44 dicks. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly, I am. Jeez, can you take the hood? Take the hood off? I can barely hear you under there. Um, alright. Hello everyone, I am Ralsei. Why do you default to different types of Yoda? <laughs> bit bit lighter maybe <laughs> no i will screw myself over with this one he has a lot of dialogue yes a lot of I... dialogue like he has yeah. probably the third most dialogue in the entire game if not the second yep great great <laughs> wait I completely forgot the one that I did. Good. Good, uh, I'm glad. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. Every voice you do is like 30 years older than the character actually is. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and uh... Best way to leave is East, right? Yes, that's where we'll... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Um, I suppose it's just the two of us then. Chris, I'm a prince, but I am currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here, um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Don't worry, Chris. I'm an NPC too. I move at this speed as well. Hey, Chris. I really think we should catch up with Susie. We can come back here after our adventure is over. And then I can bake you a yummy cake. Thanks, 
Carfax their oak. Also, he looks like he has fangs, but I know for a fact he doesn't, so it's weird. He, he, he kind of looks like he has feathers as well. I got, I got spider bites from him, I don't get, get bird bites from him. Ronsai, the lonely prince is now your ally. The power of fluffy boys shines within you. Er, uh, Crash, you know you can hold X to run, right? Really? Right. You move faster by holding X and I'll be right behind you, so don't worry. Unless you want to get away, in which case, sorry. <laughs> yeah, I have never known anyone. All I know is that no one wants to be around me. Oh, Chris, it's the training dummy I made. It looks like me. <laughs> now go, go, Chris, beat like the shit out of me. a chance to prepare for the enemy. Sorry? Go, Chris, beat the shit out of me. Would you like me to teach you how to punch? They think we should. Cause I forgot how okay, to do it. Okay, get ready, Chris. Yeah, we got five whole percentages of toilet paper from that. TP. Uh, simply. And the enemy's <laughs> attack will hurt you less. Simply. Uh. Not only that, but you also get her toilet paper. <laughs> Watch the orange big bar fuck you. <laughs> Great job, Chris. Now that you've gathered toilet paper, how about spending that toilet paper on one of my spells? Because you hit the enemy enough, it got tired. Now, if I use my pacify spell on it, acting, acting through this, even the most violent enemies, can be defeated through various acts of kindness. Wait, no, it's various acts of kindness. <laughs> of kindness. <laughs> Chris, no, it's just a dummy. Why not give it a hug? You want that because it looks like you, don't you, Ralsei? Yes. <laughs> Let's hug Ralsei instead. That's an option. We can hug the dummy or hug Ralsei. Just hug Ross, say, I feel like he needs it. Aww. C Chris. Um, I don't think, um, this is what you're supposed to be doing. But. Let's act. Dummy, attack zero defensive, a cotton heart and button eye. Looks just like a fluffy guy. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even mean for that to look like. Uh, sorry, it kind of looks like me. I've been alone, so I didn't have anyone to model it after. Chris, since it's me, please be kind to it, okay? Aw, oh, that's great, Chris. Each enemy has different acts that satisfy them. <laughs> I can't get over the fact that he's an old man. <laughs> that, that's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> I I should replace Ralsei's image with just Ralsei's head on like a fucking old man PNG. Oh, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. Shut up, old man. And uh, in case you ever heard, need a refresher, I here I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press C to open the item menu, the, the menu and use it on your items. Let's see, okay. You, you got, got the menu. menu. You got the whole fucking thing, because I didn't know what button I needed to press with this. Power. Command the party with various acts. Dark world being has no subjects. Lonely prince. Level 1 leader versus level 100 mob boss. <laughs> <laughs> He has 8 attack, 2 defense, 7 magic, 100% kindness, and his fluffiness is fluffy. Aww. I need to drink some as well, cause, cause I'm getting dehydrated. That's bad. Our fire guts are on fire. 
and we have zero magic. There is no ma we can't find the magic, guys. Oh, X I is have the fire oh, god here is made, made out of fire. He has a red scarf, whereas I has the fires here. Fire. He's just a dummy. He's just a dummy. He's just a dummy. It's just a dummy. It's just a dummy. Me when I look in the mirror. <laughs> it's just a dummy. Oh my, the great door is open. What, would you just wait, think that Susie's just like, I guess this door is closed, I can't get through. No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Bro, that's open from this side, you fucking idiot. Chris, once you pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. About, let's see here, one an hour and 30 minutes in. A journey foretold exactly by the prophecy. That I did not get the chance to say. But Chris, I believe your choices are important too. Hmm, are you sure, old man? This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. Okay, I'm, I'm really tired. I actually read <laughs> people as pedophiles first. <laughs> This world is full of all kinds of pedophiles, Chris, including me. <laughs> no, we're not making Ralph say a fucking pedophile. He's 100% kind and fluffy. Good children, in the end, <laughs> how we treat them makes all the difference. <laughs> the right man in the wrong place can make all the difference in the world, Chris. So let's try our best to get by without fighting. If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much to ask? You big baby bitch. You fucking bitch! I can handle it. Yes, it's big too much. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Chris, in the end, what you choose is up to you. As long as you're happy with it, I'm happy with it. I'm happy too. So just try your best and don't worry. I feel like you're devolving slowly. <laughs> I'm doing what? Devolving? Devolving, and then at the end you're just gonna be like... <laughs>